I remember I was walking down the street, going past Tesco, you know the Tesco on the corner? It was a really hot day, like everyone in shorts and t-shirts hot. I was wearing a pair of really old denim shorts that I've had since I was 14 and this new top that I bought from a vintage shop. It was a really cute pink top with thin little straps and a frill all around the bottom. I remember when I bought it, I specifically thought, Mum's going to think I look about 12 in this, but I didn't. I looked hot. I, I felt good. The sun streaming down on my face and the warm air soaking into my skin. I felt happy, which was nice because I've not felt like that in a long time. As I was walking, I was thinking about all the things I was going to do in the day. I was going to meet up with my friend Rose and grab some of those tin G and teas. You know, the ones you get in Sainsbury's and a packet of cigarettes, even though we don't smoke. And then we were just going to sit in the park all afternoon, basking in the sun. I was thinking about how cute I was going to look when all my freckles come out on my face and how funny Rose is going to look when she burns all over. She's got really fair skin, but she never seems to put on any sunscreen. She says that the chemicals in sunscreen is bad for her skin. But I told her that burning and getting skin cancer is bad for her skin. So she can be so stubborn sometimes. And just as my mind was going to take me on a long journey about all the things Rose is stubborn about, I heard someone call after me. I could barely turn to look in the direction of where the call came from when a hand grabbed my arm and pulled me into the alley. It's amazing how many thoughts you can have as you walk a few metres down the street. But suddenly nothing. There were no thoughts. The hand. The big, clammy hand. That was the last thing I remember.